Foxtrot, this is the wizard. Do you read me, Sitting Duck? This is Peking Duck. I hear you, Blizzard. No, Sly, I'm the wizard, and you're Sitting Duck. I read you loud and clear, Lizard. No, I, I'm... Forget it, you're not taking this seriously. Yeah, I'm not. Look, Bentley, I know this is your first time out in the field, but you've gotta loosen up. If we're gonna get to those clockwork parts, I need you on your toes. So in plain talk, what's your status? Well, I've established myself in the basement, and I'm pretty sure I can rewire the service elevator if you could power it up from that security station. Hang tough, pal. It might take some time, but I'll figure out a way to get up there. All right, Tonse, Tonse, people. My name is Sin K. You can call me Sin for short. And welcome to Sly Cooper 2 and the Band of Thieves. I think it's. I think that's the title. I said it properly. Things may be looking a little rough around the edges. I put a patch, a widescreen patch on. I don't know if it's optimized very well, but bear with me. I am on an emulator, so it may not run perfect, though, right? You guys already know land. Okay, I splice the wires. Out! Hold on. There it is. Ooh, Bentley! Bentley, the brains. Hey. Okay, okay. I think we're robbing Bentley a bank. Security computer. The spotlights are offline. Oh boy. There goes the laser security system. Working I can still the throw. Security gate. I mean, I can still hit, throw, throw. I can still swing. Oh my god, why did I say throw? Presto, all clear. Thanks, pal. For your first time out, you did pretty well. Oh, this operation is far from complete. Now that the lasers and spotlights are offline, Furry should be moving into position for your rendezvous. I'll stay here and provide computer support while you go on ahead. All right. Okay. Now we have to go provide support. Oh. Uh, attention all guards. Oh, hey. These are the enemy's bosses from last time. Look at all this artwork. Yeah, those are the bosses, the five bosses, all on that one wall there. That's so cool. I get it, I know. Don't have to tell me. I'm a veteran. Just kidding, no. I only consider myself a veteran when we get to the third game. Then I'll consider myself a badass veteran. Do, 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 do. Oh, you mean Murray got lost? What the fuck? <laughs> Murray, the brawn. Greetings, citizen. I hope you weren't harmed by my meteoropic entrance. No, Murray, I, I kept it a safe distance. Good, good. The Thunderflop knows neither friend nor foe. Only destruction. Yeah, could you maybe channel some of that raw energy into the security gate? Of course. It is nothing before the Murray. The Murray? Why does he sound so different? Oh, oh shit. Okay. All clear. 
You can stop now, Murray. Whoa, what the fuck was that? That looked like a Lego piece. That was so cool. Another barrier stands before you. Fear not. I shall bend it like the truth. Dude, that's such a cold hard line. I shall bend it like Solid the truth. Work, Murray. You're really in the zone. My hulking frame is too much for that puny rope. You go ahead and unlock the doors from the inside. I'll be waiting in the hallway to help you carry out the clockwork parts. Hey, okay. Thank you, Murray. going on freeze cooper inspector fox as beautiful and unpredictable as ever whereas you crooks are so predictable you always return to the scene of the crime crime i haven't stolen anything yet oh really then who broke in last night and made off with all the clockwork parts you've got the motive someone already stole the parts don't play dumb with me it might not have been him calmita the method of entry and guard casualties all point to this being a claw gang job. The claw gang? Constable Neela, I allowed you to sit in on this stakeout as a favor to the Contessa. I really don't need any help. Oh, I think you might. Look at the facts. Facts? Sly Cooper is right here. I caught him red-handed. I'm just saying that there are other criminals in the world other than... Sly Cooper! After him! Oh, God. Please! Oh no. Holy shit, that's even faster than last time. Shake a leg, Murray. It's time to go. Hold still. Did her voice change? Wasn't part of the plan. Yeah, well, this is where Oh my god. Oh! Stop, thief. <sighs> Run. <sighs> Run. Oh my god, she's so fast. Get back here, Ringtail. This is getting a little hot. You guys go warm up the van. I'll keep Carmelita busy. You're all going to jail. Pick me up at the rendezvous. Oh boy. Someone already stole the parts and framed us. You can't run forever. Yes, I can. Watch me. I'm going. I'm going. Go 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 Carmelita's just as angry as ever. She's really quite lovely when she's angry. And that Constable Neela, was a reference to the Claw Gang just a slip of the tongue or an intentional clue? Either way, it's her only lead on the missing clockwork parts. Mm. Clockwork. He was consumed with jealousy for the Cooper clan's thieving reputation. Is it inappropriate to refer to him as a monster? No, not at all. What kind of person stays alive for hundreds of years with the express intention of wiping out a rival's family line? Imagine the hatred fueling that first decision to replace his mortal body with soulless machinery. Ultimately, it did the trick. Clockwork lived on. He caught up with my parents, and I wound up in an orphanage. Okay. It's there that I met my pals, Bentley, the brains of our outfit, and Murray the brawn. They turned out to be all the family I needed. Two years ago, I thought I'd finished it. How naive to think I could so easily put an end to that kind of hatred. And now he's back. 
In pieces, sure, but the threat is real. Does the Claw Gang even realize what they've stolen? I don't know what's in my future, but I won't let it be a repeat of my past. Fly to Band of Thieves. Episode 1. Oh, so this is the hub now. Let's go. <laughs> I had to call in a few favors to get the goods on the Claw Gang's local operator. Dimitri, a sort of underworld celebrity, equally at home in high-class art circles and shady back-alley crimes. He was once a passionate young art student who worked hard to develop his own visionary style. Unfortunately, the art world wasn't quite ready for his kinetic aesthetic. Aww. So he gave them what they wanted, and started forging old masterpieces. His way of punishing those with bad taste. Wow. Dimitri now runs a nightclub on the west side. The thumping music, colorful light shows, and a hint of danger lure in chic young patrons from far and wide. And it's here, hidden somewhere, where we'll find the clockwork tail feathers. What Dimitri plans to do with the clockwork part is beyond me. But those plans end tonight. Sly Cooper and the gang in... The Black Chateau. Oh my god, that's so cool. Play a slot to sell loot and buy gadgets. What? How can we sell? Oh. Oh. So money does matter in this game. All right, let's begin. <laughs> I tell you, Bentley, it's going to be a real pleasure robbing this nightclub. I share in your enthusiasm, but before we hit the inside, we'll need to do a little reconnaissance work. What do you have in mind? I've installed this special antenna on the safe house to help with our first job, hacking into Dimitri's satellite array. The coordinates for the job start beacon have been uploaded to your binoculum. Make your way to this position, and I'll give you a full briefing on our objective. I'm on my way. All right, let's get on the road with this. If you click the L3 button, you know, press the left analog stick. Oh. Put virtual markers into your feet basket. They'll help you find your way around. If no markers are in view, use the right analog stick to move the camera and look around for them. 30? Remember, the view is always better from the rooftops. Okay, so it's more of like an open world game now. Oh, that's so cool. I wonder if I can get over there. I want to get up there. We're doing so good like this. I love that. Okay, I want to try to get most of the bottles. Like I said, we're not going to collect everything in the first run. You know this.
Ooh. I know, I know. There's one behind there. Oh, I just love the way that sounds. It sounds so dope. What? Oh, they don't get... Oh. Run. Oh, they don't run this time. Interesting. Very different, I gotta say. So I, I didn't know, I didn't understand. I don't understand the combat system. They changed it, which I'm actually shocked by. Sly, I need you to hack into Dimitri's communication array so that we'll have access to his database. How am I supposed to do that? To start, you'll need to get to the top of that tower. Then reposition the satellite dish to point at my safe house antenna. If you want to climb on stuff, jump and hit the circle button to grab hold. We already know that. Try climbing up that pipe. Right. Jump and press the circle button to climb pipes. I'm on it. I'm on it. Dude, I almost got caught. So the whole premise now, or the whole thing, is that we have to collect the parts that we originally got from Clockwork, which we destroyed. I know, I know. Yeah, yeah, I know. Oh, boy. I am trying to <laughs> do this properly. This may crash. I am using a texture pack to make the thing to make everything pop. It's like an HD texture texture blah 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 texture pack. I found it online. Uh, I found it on a YouTube video, and I thought it looked really nice. Oh my god, I am failing this. Why can't? Do I have to? Okay. Looks like you can't hold a uh, circle. You have to tap it just as you land. That's way different than the first game. First game I could hold circle and jump and then it would activate. Whoa, okay. Yeah, no, everything is different now. The movement. Everything feels way different. So a little bit like slower pace, you know what I mean? Oh. Ooh, I could jump up there. Oh my god. Let's get out of here. Oh boy. Okay, where do we go from here? Over there. All right. I went completely like opposite. I don't know why. I just was following the bottles. In money. <laughs> Sorry. Fly, if you're ever confused about what to do next, press the L3 button yes. and look around for waypoints. I know, I'm just collecting bottles, Bentley. Chill, buddy, chill. 
God damn. God motherfucking damn. <laughs> Doesn't understand how, uh, how badass I am. Oh, over there. Okay, um, I guess we can just cut through here, right? Yeah. Dude, there are so many enemies. What? Didn't we just come from there? No. Wait, no, the f there was a far one. Ah. Alright, keep your secrets. Hey. That's two. So I can run, okay. Dude, I need ten more. Do this. All right, we've done it. Hey, look at all that data. Job completed. Nice work, Sly. I'm downloading from Dimitri's mainframe as we speak. All in a night's work. So, where do we go from here? Your next job is to break into the nightclub and take some reconnaissance photos of the clockwork tail feathers. To get inside, you'll have to sneak through an old wine cellar beneath town. Okay, I'll head out for the cellar. So we gotta head- oh! Bruh, I could've walked past you. Okay, we're gonna look for these, like, the nine others, and then, uh, if I can't find them right away, uh, we'll just continue on, I guess? Mm. 23. Oh, wait, we've been over here. That's right. Oh, there's one. Oh, look, there's a second one over there. 24. Why? 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 Okay, there we go. And now we go up. Why? There's one. Way back here. 26 out of 30. Oh my god, four more. There's one more right here. And that would be 27. Heck yeah. There's 28. Wait, is it 28? Yeah, two more. Now nah, I have no idea where I'm gonna find them. Is that 29 I see? Yeah, there's 29. One more to go, I think I can find it. Oh my god, I found 30. I did not check up here. Well, that's Hell yeah. But we still don't know where the vault is. 
That's true. Good to see you, little buddy. I guess the way through the wine cellar is guarded by those rats. Bentley thought you might like some help clearing them out. Sounds like fun. You and me, back to back? Totally. Outnumbered, fighting impossible odds. It's perfect. All right, pal. Let's get to it. Oh, hell yeah. We get to fight? Fear the Oh my god. Murray is a beast, bro. Look at him go. Let me lower those bars for you. There you go. To get over this thing, you'll have to double jump. Hit the X button to jump. Then, while in the air, press it again to get some extra air time. Looks like you're on your own from here. Eh, I'm used to it. Thanks for the help. Anytime, partner. Hell yeah. Love you, Murray. I love him. Oh, it's, it's the infamous lasers again. Why? In order to get past these lasers, you need to crawl under that table. To do that, oh my God. get near the table and press the circle button. I'm scared. These flashlight guards are too tough to fight head on. Crawl under the tables to sneak around him. Oh, is he... Is he gonna move? Oh, shit. How am I supposed to... Oh, man. Oh, God. Oh, this is so... nerve-wracking. This air vent leads into Dimitri's nightclub. Hit the circle button to crawl inside. I am. I'm doing it. I'm crawling through the vents. Chill. Chill, buddy. Relax. In order to shut down those yellow lasers, you'll need to take out that guard. Sneak up behind him and press the triangle button to knock him into the air. Then, the square button to slam and finish him off. Got that? The triangle button, then the square button. Wow. Well, that worked. I didn't think of that. Anything in here? Nah, it doesn't look like it. Okay. That sneak attack slam move only works on guards who haven't seen you. Wait until this guy turns his back, and then let him have it. Oh, please. Don't come this way, don't come this way, don't come this way, don't come this way, don't come this way. Oh, okay, good. Oh. He, that does work very well. Oh my god. I knew that earlier. Oh, shit. If you get in a fight with those rats, the sneak attack won't work. It's purely a stealth move. All right, sneaky. Whoa. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitches. Come on, bitches. Get up. Uh. Holy shit, that was cool. I love that. I love the new combat in this game. What the heck? Aha, another air vent. Judging by the angle, it should lead to the printing press room. Right. Wait a minute, does this take me somewhere? I want to try something. There's something over here. Can I go over there? Oh, I don't think I can. Darn. I thought I was cool, because I thought I could get on the chandelier, but I don't think I can even get on that thing. We can try. Yeah, no. Whatever. So let's go in the vent. 
I thought I was being cool. Money printing. Dimitri's using the clockwork tail feathers as printing plates. Given their rare alloy, they'll never wear out. Unlimited forged money. That's so cool. Also, very, very smart, but scummy as well. Oh. That's our target. Dimitri, professional lounge lizard and international forger. That should do it, Sly. Head back to the safe house and we'll cook up a plan of attack. The recon photos are a grim reminder of what the modern thief is up against. Spotlights, stepped up patrols, the sum of it all renders a direct assault impossible. To solve this puzzle, I'm going to need some more intelligence. First, replace this bugged painting with one Dimitri has in his office. Once in place, we should be able to listen in on his communications. Second, if you see the boss, tail him. We might learn something from studying his movements. Ah. Once we've got a proper understanding of the operation, those clockwork tail feathers are as good as ours. Oh, dude, I love it. Do I have enough for something? Oh, not even close. Trigger bomb. Fists of flame. Turn ordinary punches into fury ones. You don't have enough points to buy this item. Smoke bomb. Oh, dude, these sound so cool. Okay, let's move on now. I get it. Bug Dimitri's office. Alright, let's go bug his office. Who the fuck is that? Is that a lizard on the roof? Oh my god. able to listen in on his conversations. Yes, I thought things might go more smoothly with an ear on the inside. Just be careful with the fine art. Take any damage and the painting's ruined. All right. So I just have to make it and not get damaged. That's easy enough, I guess. Ah, oh, man, I'm gonna eat my own words, am I? I'm a little scared, a little sketched out. I like, I just know something's gonna happen. You know what I mean? Like, I just, I can just tell. Let's jump up here. Go over here. 
I, I want to avoid as much combat as possible. Is this where we want it to go? Oh god. Oh no. The schematic indicates that door is locked from the inside. That's alright. I never was one for the direct approach. Swell, because the indirect approach is way up there through that air vent. Oh man. We can do this. How am I gonna get up there? Nope. Nope, I knew it. I knew it. Okay. Ooh. Oh, I don't want to start a fight for no reason. Can I swing off of that? Oh, man. All right, I'm gonna have to be very stealthy here. That's one rat. Okay, so fighting one won't alert the other. I sure hope so. Oh. Oh. No. All right. Fuck. All right, we're going to try a new approach. It's a little aggressive, but it doesn't matter. What the fuck was that? Oh, I'm so scared. Well, somehow that worked. Somehow in some way. Now to replicate it, but I don't know how. Okay, there we go. Well, that works. I don't have to deal with those two because they're going to go up there and stay on their set. So we are going to go along and deal with all these lasers. A little scared. I don't want to break anything. Oh. Oh my god, this just feels like a 2005 game. Nice work, Sly. The bug's in position. If you manage to get the original painting back to me in one piece, I could sell it through my internet connections and make us a ton of coins. Hell yes. Oh. It's a 
took some higher level math, but I believe the coach in Dimitri's vault is two, three, one. Oh, they even changed that. What is that? Knockout dive. Uh -huh. Oh, great. Now what? Do we just go the same way? I mean, it's pretty simple, so. Hey, we're massive thieves. Good at this. Avoid getting spotted by the oh, oh, oh. Oh, we can run from them. Oh, never actually thought of that. I thought fighting to the end was, you know, <laughs> like the only option. Well, now I know we could run away from them. We don't. We don't have to continue fighting, which is a good thing. Oh my God! Almost didn't make it. <gasps> oh. I'm scared to fall. Shit, I fell. Oh no. I keep holding down circle when I don't mean to. Okay, let's go back. Yeah, we wanted to go here. Let me sell it. Let me sell that shit. Yes. <laughs> We're so close. I think Fist of Fury will be so helpful. Yeah, we'll save. All right. I think this is where I'm going to leave off this first episode, guys. It's uh, a little over an hour, actually. But we'll see what happens when I edit it. But yeah, tell me what you guys think so far. I'm I'm loving it. I'm loving all the new changes and everything. Okay. Also, the 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 story. I'm really intrigued. I'm just also in awe of how great this game looks. It holds up till till this till this day. And I hope you guys join me on this journey of going through all the Sly Cooper games. And then right after Sly Cooper, we're going right into all the God of War games. And then right after that, we're going into um, Metroid. And we're just gonna keep the ball rolling. You know, we're just gonna keep going. Anyways, I have nothing else to say now, man. I'm I'm very lost. <laughs> and uh, with that, bye bye. Smile there. Make sure to have a good dinner tonight. Make sure to have some burgers and vegetables and potatoes and whatnot. That's what I'm gonna be having tonight. So, anyways, bye 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 bye. -bye. bye, -bye.